Greetings internet, it's me Terry with another video and yeah, I got Red Dead Redemption 2 for PC. I've been waiting for it for a long time. Looking real forward to playing it. And you want to you want to know what what the funniest thing is? The funniest thing is that this game came out with a lot of issues for a lot of people. I hear a lot of people complaining in it. Uh, complaining about this this game having issues launching the game and you would think that maybe they just forgot to update their windows drivers or maybe they uh, missed one of the Microsoft framework updates or maybe they're not they didn't do the Vulcan update or DirectX 12 or who knows, you know, just just one of the things that you should do before you install a new game is make sure all your stuff's updated, make sure you have the latest graphics drivers and basically make sure every piece of your computer hardware is up to date all your drivers for everything you know but yeah i i did all that i made sure i did all that but the point of this video is actually to laugh at the funniest thing i discovered which well is actually annoying and frustrating because i would have loved to pay for this game on Steam or GOG because I use Steam and GOG. They're they're great platforms. Both are you know the most heavily used launchers. Steam and GOG. Everybody knows. Everybody buys games on. And it, it's so frustrating to see. The uh, EA Origin, the Epic Game Store, and now, now we have Rockstar with its own game store. What the heck? Why? Why does every game developer feel like they have to open their own game store? It's frustrating for the consumer. The consumer does not want to have to install a game launcher for every developer there's gonna get i mean there's got to be a point where people just say no because it's getting ridiculous but anyway i'm ranting and i didn't mean for this video to be a rant video the the funny thing that i wanted to share the the funniest thing that i got out of all this is that they created a shortcut for Red Dead Redemption 2 and I said okay I'll put a shortcut on the desktop and I tried opening the game I was like oh I'll just open it from the desktop because that's what sh shortcuts are for right well funny thing the shortcut does not open the game so what's the point of a shortcut if it just tells you to open the rockstar games launcher and run the game from there so yeah that 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 made me laugh oh rockstar oh what have you done what have you done? <laughs> so yeah, I just I just had to make a video showing that Rockstar is kind of uh, baffling, ignorant, prideful. I don't know. They Rockstar is a lot of things and. Ah, uh, it. 
I, I I have no words for this. This is the silliest thing. They created a shortcut that's a waste of space. It's just a pretty picture to put on your desktop. Say, hey, you got Red Dead Redemption 2. Why don't you open the game launcher so you can play it? I guess that's what it boils down to. They wanted you to use their launcher so much that they gave you a desktop icon so that you could open the launcher. Yeah, that's the point. That's the point. What a joke. What a joke. Take care, everyone. And have a lovely day.